Hi, I'm Rahayu. Today I'll be bringing you to the BBE Community Centre. The CC has hosted many significant, important events as well as festivities and it continues to be an important place for residents to get resources as well as assistance. Today I'll be sharing my memories of the CC. Let's start here at the front where you see two beautiful lions. Many believe they are here to protect and guard the people in this area. I'm sure that's true, but I want to give due credit to the MPC which is right beside us. The MPC had played a vital role in keeping our residents safe and secure. And I'm happy that after this renovation, they will still be within our compounds. So this is our open courtyard. It has also seen many fun activities. I remember one time I had uh, joined the festivities and also did the Uriadi during a Pongal festival where I had to actually break a pot hung from up high with my eyes blindfolded. It was really fun. So after the renovations, we're going to have this area covered and the area is going to be opened up so that there will be more common spaces for the residents to enjoy. Do you know how old the CC is? So here is a plaque. It was officially opened by Mr. Go Chok Tong, who was then the Prime Minister on 9th of March 2003. Come, join us. So this is our visitor's lounge. We've had many meetings here, discussing many different projects and activities for the residents of Bukit Batok East. And one of the initiatives and programs that was born from the discussions here was the Blanja Meal program. It's actually a program where we encourage patrons of the different coffee shops to donate an extra meal. And these meals are then given to those who are in need. So this is the BBE CC Hall. It's a huge space and we've had so many activities and events here like Hari Raya, Chinese New Year, Deepa Bali, and also the Children's Day celebrations. Come, take a look at that piece of art over there. So this is something that we did in 2018 as part of the Passion Arts Festival. We involved many, many residents and many months of organising and work to get residents to put many push pins on this art piece. Come. So this is our conference room. It's a huge space and we've had many meetings here. Usually I have the CCC or CCMC meetings and we've also hosted our partners, stakeholders and agencies to discuss about various things to improve the infrastructure and all the different things happening here at Bukit Batok East. So this is indeed a memorable space for me. I have a couple of paintings I want to show you. So this is a piece done by one of our residents, Ms. Tan Cheng Cheng, and she actually wanted to present it to the then Prime Minister Go Chok Tong when he officiated the CC. He had requested that we keep it here, and I'm also going to make sure that this finds its place in the new CC. There's one more piece. So this was done by the Yusuf Ishak Secondary School students, depicting all the different precedents. Isn't it lovely? But it's missing one precedent, the current one, and she was actually the advisor of this constituency for 15 years. I'm sure you know who she is. So these are the classrooms at level 3 and we use them for various things, activities, workshops. The classroom at the corner is actually a space we reserve for students who need a space to study. During the exam period, my youth executive committee sometimes come up with packages to give to the students. So after the renovation, this area is going to be converted to dance studios. There will be a lot more space, a lot more light coming through and I'm excited for the change. Now I'd like to bring you to our home craft room which actually houses our kitchen. This has also been a place where many residents learned new skills, learned new recipes because there are cooking classes conducted here. In recent times, we've had our BBE home cooking delights here being shot. So this is something that will be always a fond memory for me. This is level 4 and I'm very excited about the changes that we're going to make to this space. This will be a space where we will extend the childcare area as well as create the student care space. 
And you know, keeping healthy and active is also very important to the residents of Bukit Batok East. We already have a gym downstairs. We are going to move it up here, make it a bit bigger and nicer. I'm sure many of you have not been to this floor, right? Here, take a look. It's a beautiful, huge space. And I'm happy to share with you that we will be having our new culinary studio here. We also have a new lounge for the singing interest group to practice and we'll add more greenery to this space. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed the little tour with me around Bukit Batok ECC. I'm sure you're excited about all the new things that's to come. I am excited. While we wait for the renovations to complete, we'll be launching the Memories of BBE project. So this is a project where we're calling all photographs, stories and all the different things that you want to share with us about your memories here at Bukit Batok East. So I look forward to your contribution and I hope to see you soon. Bye!